Charlie, a lot of people do not believe in the moon. You know, what are some of the suppressors that they probably experience while they're hunting? Well, Brad, probably the three of the biggies are air temperature, human pressure, and weather fronts. And those are probably the three that really contribute to uh, low activity when you talk about prime time in the rut. Let's take the biggie. Anybody that's ever traveled is going to be talking about the fact that they went someplace, whether it's Iowa, Illinois, or wherever, and they say, man, we got there and we had hot temperatures. Well, in the research that Wayne LaRoche and I are doing, we're actually tracking air temperature from October to the end of the year. And uh, there's been years we've done it every four minutes. And what that has shown us, where I live north of the 40th latitude, which is western New York State, is that whenever we have air temperature 45 degrees or warmer, it suppresses deer activity. They shut down because whitetails don't have sweat glands like we do and they can't function. So heat is a real suppressor. Weather fronts, what I mean by that is heavy snow, heavy rain moving through the area. When that event hits, it's normally going to last four to eight hours and those animals will go on their belly. It could be prime time rut. It could be when everything's cranking and all of a sudden it crashes. Well, when that front moves out, man, they're up moving again and human pressure. There's been a lot of research done on what human pressure does to deer and normally it will turn them nocturnal in about 30 hours. And so consequently there's a, there's a host of things that come into play here that could make one area of the country, everything's cranking, everything's great, everything's as predicted, you could be 30 miles away and if you've got certain things happening it's crashed and everybody's saying wow we're not seeing anything, this stuff can't be right. And so the key thing that we've talked about in the past is this isn't exact. We're talking about an animal. We're talking about, uh, you know, how things are going to kind of shake out. Well, everything has to be perfect for it to work the way you exactly say it's going to be.